The Smoking Bear is the first ever cannabis dispensary to operate in Gardner, Montana. Located just outside of the federal Yellowstone National Park, they're hoping to change Montana's rhetoric on weed use. I've always felt like a dispensary would be a good addition to the community. Um, I've seen a lot of really good medicinal use um, in my adult life and, uh, of course, recreational as well. Stacy Joy is the owner of The Smoking Bear. She explains how after having to wait 18 months for a license, lawmakers threw a crimp in business plans, postponing new licensing even further. Anyone like myself, uh, an entrepreneur that was ready and just ready to go to uh, open a new dispensary, we were now told that that's not going to happen for at least another two years. The Smoking Bear was able to open after partnering with local Bozeman dispensary, The Lazy Days. Despite state resistance, Stacy says the Gardner community was welcoming, even coming together to help her open after the unexpected death of her boyfriend and business partner, Justin Bell. I am a business owner in other ways in Gardner, um, and I think people know that my intentions are good, and I absolutely love this community. Despite being a relatively young community of rafters, Stacy says customer demographic isn't what you'd expect. It is people... Um, you know, in their 50s and 60s, they have aches and pains, they have trouble sleeping, um, or it's a novice uh, opportunity for tourists that have never been in a dispensary before. Being a tourist town, dispensaries charge an additional resort tax on goods, contributing to the local economy. Stacy hopes to find other ways to give back to the community, too. So I'm, I'm anxious to see how the Smoking Bear can fit in to our um, nonprofit community in town as well. I know it's not going to be as welcome uh, with all events, but we'll find the niche that we can feel like we are helpful and we can give back um, because I do believe that that is very important for, for small towns. Despite recreational weed use being legalized in the state, use of it on federal lands and waters is still prohibited. In Gardner, Heaven Van, MTN News.